All right, what's up? It's Cheetah. And of course, you watching True Friend TV. Um, honestly, I'm so excited. I really wanted to come up with a way to um, get my channel messages across because they're so strong, you know. I did want to get them out. So, I came up with da -da -da -da, YouTube Motherfuckers, inspired by Real Life Dilemmas, and brought to you by your girl, Cheetah K. <laughs> Alright, so, um, yes, I am excited to do this. And so, um, it's, it's what, Saturday? It's like 2 o'clock in the morning where I'm at. So, of course, I'm in Louisiana. So, this will about be the time when I do this. I'll probably do it once a week on Saturdays. Um, yeah. So, um, this is how it's going to go down. First of all, this is audio only. There will not be any video included with that. I know, right? Uh, I know you want to see my beautiful face, but, um, no, all I need you to do with your fine ass is just listen to my voice, which I know is a little irritating considering the fact that I have like a slurred tongue, but I can't help it. My bad. <laughs> so, okay, next, the second thing is I will not call out any zodiac signs until the very, very end, okay? All right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right, and so um, last but not least, but this is the most important thing. This is not a vice versa type of deal. Um, it is what it is. When I pull for you, person watching, that's what it is. I'm not going to say... Um, oh, this might be that person, or this might be, or this, no. This is your energy only. And the same thing when I pull for the other person. This is their energy only. And Spirit told me to make sure that I made that point clear, even to myself. So if you hear me say vice versa, or this might be you, or this might be them, or anything like that, please put my ass on blast, all right? All right. So... These are the questions that we will ask on both sides. On your side, it will be who, and then I'll let you know what sex and who I feel like the per the people are involved, what is going on, when is it going on, why is it going on, what they got to say about it, how the money looking, I'm going to get in the money section of the other shit, I think that will be cool too, and um, what your buddy had to say about it, and what happened when you went through their phone. Then I'm going to do the next person the same way. All right? And then I decide on whether or not to pull a lover's oracle or a spirit from, um, a postcard from spirit. Sorry. Okay? All right. So, I already have everything done, of course. I do all my, I do my blessings and shuffling and everything. I do all of that, um before I get on the camera because I know shuffling the cards I loud even though I am gonna do it one time just for habit for each deck okay all right so let me get to the who 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 you talking about all right let's see let's get to for the who okay oh Okay, so we got, um, we have a mother and a son. It looks like a teenage son. We have a mother and a teenage son. And then we have the mother and the teenage son, okay? So we got them. And then we got the man here. Now, this man is, um, he is, uh, what, what would you put this? Like, uh, he's a nice dressing guy. Or whatever, but he might be a little, um, he might be a little bit too much. Like, like this woman might feel like this man is just a little bit too much for her. I don't know if he's too much on the emotional side or too, too overbearing. I don't think it's overbearing. I think he re requires a lot of, um, attention. I think this man likes to get his ass kissed. So, therefore, this woman... And her son, her teenage son, they're um, uncomfortable with with him right now at the at the time. 
when 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 let me see when let's see when did the situation what situation and when did the situation go down i don't like that don't be fucking with the kids all righty also this this man uh will be the father and the husband the husband or the father so he is the father of this teenage boy and he is this woman's husband okay so this goes down all the time all the time so this is an all the time situation all right this is an all the time situation i'm not gonna uh, look too much into how much more time with that because that's as long as they've been married probably as long as they had this this son i don't know if that's the only child they have together but i will ask well no nah, i don't need to ask that's the only kid like i said i gotta it's gonna take me some time to get used to it but this is not a second guess the situation this is what it is all right all right so basically he um he's concerned about of course he should be concerned about his child but i don't feel like his concern is is towards the child i believe that his concern is is towards money he's thinking of money or he's feeling like he doesn't have enough money You know what, my bad, because I was just trying to figure out um, how did I drift off into both of these. But this is what's going on. I have to get, um, I have to get used to this. But this is what's going on. His uh, story is, is going to come out um, right now. So we we on the man, we on the father slash husband, okay? And what his problem is right now, okay? Okay, so he's concerned about money and he feels like his wife is just um, spending the money. Yeah, he feels like his wife is just spending spending the money. I don't know. She let me I don't know. Is, is she saving or what? Or is she just spending his hard earned money? Okay, yeah. See, the wife is spending the money and she's not staying focused on the goals that they have. Oh, wifey. Okay, so we're going to get into her while her reasoning is. Okay, she's not focused on the goals that they have right now. Why? 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 Let me see. Why is she not focused on their goals right now? Because they're supposed to have relationship goals. They're in it together. This is what they said. They're married. They have this teenage child. So this isn't new. So what's changed all of a sudden with this uh, hot tamale? Let's see. Okay, because it hurts. Wow, because it hurts. Mm. Let me see what hurts you, baby. Okay, let me see what hurts you. Because it hurts. I don't like that. I don't. I don't know. I could tell that it's hurting, and it's it's it definitely looks like it's a little bit of pain going on right here. Why is it some mental? Okay. Because of anger. Okay, so maybe the husband. Okay, so this is what's going on. This is exactly what's going on. A uh, husband and daddy is mean to um, wife and son. Wife and teenage son. He's mean because he's uh he's constantly thinking about money. Constantly thinking about paying the bills. Con he's very concerned about um the way his money is being spent and he's starting to feel as though he's in poverty maybe with all of this stuff that's uh let me see let me see why he's starting to feel like he is in poverty let me see number 37 yeah well shit i definitely understand where he coming from because shit okay if you go through your partner's phone you have trust issues yes or no so he feels like he's in poverty because, uh, simply because the mother and the wife is spending all his money and she's going places that she has no business going. Golly, girl. Alrighty. So he's angry about that and he's hurt by this. 
okay so right so if you go through your partner's phone then you have trust issues yes or no well let's see let's see what he gonna find when he go through her phone i'm gonna get an inbox on her right now so he's going through her phone right and we all know the sound that i make for the phone tring-a-ling-a-ling tring-a-ling-a-ling <laughs> all righty okay here we go Ooh, i definitely enjoyed shucking corn with you but what if we just caught a movie next time who the fuck she talking to who is she talking to let's get a reply back from her phone wife wifey mama no 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 we not gonna have that baby your ass is gonna get exposed your ass is gonna get exposed let's see we gonna get a reply on your phone right now all right here we go here go the reply i refuse to answer that until i am sober let's talk monday so girl you running around with a motherfucker who okay so this your inbox and this is the reply so you can't talk to him till monday anyway because you're gonna be at home with your husband until he go to work over the weekend so y'all probably hung out it says today and what's today today is friday so this is exactly what the message say at the top it say 4 20 p.m today so y'all hung out friday while a uh, honey husband was at work and you gotta play it off with homeboy or whoever this is because you know everything goes on nowadays so you gotta play it off with them like you so like you drunk like you so drunk that you can't even talk on the phone until monday but really, you got to play the game at home with your husband, right? Mm. All right. Well, really, I'm sorry, husband. I'm supposed to be talking to you. Really, husband, she supposed to be, uh, she, she texting this shit to somebody on the side, to some side nigga or some side chick or whoever she's seeing on the side shucking corn. I don't know. But she won't, she refused to answer them. She got to keep them hanging on, husband, until Monday when you take your ass back to work. Ooh, ooh. that's not good. All righty. Let me see how that makes you feel. Let me, let me see what you got to say about that. Let me see what you got to say about that because I know you got something to say. Let me see what you got to say about that, husband. Come on, say something. What you got to say, husband? Say something. Yes. Who is this lady? I tell you one thing for sure and for certain. They definitely got the game all the way fucked up, don't they? Mm-hmm. All right. Let's see what you got to say, husband. We're going to use a period card on that. All righty. Okay. Come on, husband. All righty. Let me get you. Let me get you a little help. Cause you might not even know what to say. You don't even know what to say with this, with this chick, with your wife, with your baby mama, with your teenage son. And now she want to get all buck wild and shit after 12, 13 years. Okay. All right. Um, and you say my king, my queen vibes, true love. Well, you know what, husband? I'm going to tell you one thing for sure. One thing for certain is that, um, you know. Even though this may hurt, you could always be forgiven once you find out or if you find out or when you find out or when y'all talk about it, okay? Will you be forgiven? I don't know. Let me ask. I'm going to ask these cards everything. Let me ask, will you be forgiven? How would you, how you going to feel once you, once you find out? Okay? So if you go through your partner's phone, will you have trust issues? Okay, and so you have partnership. You will be very forgiven. You'll be very forgiven. All right. Now, let me get one more. I got one more because I want to ask what, what your buddy's going to say when you tell them about this shit on the phone. When you tell them what you seen on her, um, on, through, when you went through Miss Lady Phone. Okay. Let me see what you going to say. What your partner's going to What your partner going to say? I'm so curious to know how that's going to come across. <laughs> What's your partner going to say? Because if you call me with that shit, I'm going to be like, okay, your partner says this. Mm, 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 mm. When life gives you lemons, man, bro, 
make lemonade, be optimistic, have perseverance, explore other opportunities, get creative, and you are a genius. Golly, you got some good ass friends, man. You gonna be okay. Okay, 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 okay. So, little mama. Little mama. Let's, uh, let's see what's up with you. I mean, why you doing all this that you do with this man, okay? Now, uh, I'm gonna tell you like this. See, I'm single, little mama. You hear me what I say? I'm single. I'm single. You know, I know things change after 12, 13 years, but I'm single, and I wouldn't treat my man like this. I don't know. Maybe I would, but I probably wouldn't because I don't have enough fucking energy. Shit. All right. Let's see what you got going on. All right. What's your story, ma'am? What is you up to? All righty. So you, uh, so you, 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 you broke. Oh, uh, Okay. So you broke, and your motherfucking friends always trying to hang out, okay? And they always expecting you to hang out, but you can't hang. You used to couldn't hang out because you didn't have no money. Mm. You used to couldn't hang out because you ain't had no money. Let me get one more up on this. Why you ain't had no money, though? Let me see. What, you don't go to what? Because, co co what? Corona? Let me see. Girl, let me get one for your money. Let me get one for your money. Matter of fact, I got something better for your ass. Let me get one for your money, honey. You ain't had no money. You wasn't expecting none or nothing, huh? Just all, okay. But your friends wanted to hang out, so you was waiting on your husband to get paid. Right, okay. So when when that happened, and you just said, well, hold on. Okay. Bills travel through the mail at twice the speed of checks. Okay, baby. So you was busy paying bills. I could dig it. I definitely could dig it because that's what the fuck I'm over here doing, baby. Alrighty. Well, you paid your bills, so you had some money, I guess. So I guess, you know, but I'm trying to figure out. Mm, I'm going I'm to see. I'm going to see what you got to say about that, baby. I'm not going to rush it, okay? So, okay. This is your number 39, okay? So do you know how to be who you need to be when you need to get those things done? Okay. So, okay. So here we go right here with the bullshit. Now, you acting like happy wife, happy life while you at home to get your husband some money, to get your, your, your teenage, your, your baby daddy, your teenage son's father money, right? And when you go out in the streets, let's see what you acting like when you go out in the streets. I just need to know. You acting like you, oh, you act, oh, oh, you sick with it when you get out, when you get out in the street. You just gonna do whatever you want to do. Okay. So when did you start doing, doing this shit? I need to know because I feel like I'm pretty sure y'all been married for about 12 years around that time span okay so when did you start doing this shit that's what i want to know you started doing this shit 10 months ago okay 10 months ago baby that's cool who you doing this with who who you running around, who you running around town with you just with your friends or let me see are you just with your friends uh what you out here doing mama what you out here doing because i need to let my mans know because uh we ain't finna have that. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I tell you one thing for sure. One thing for certain. Your friends ain't always around. Okay, girl. I want. Girl, I like to call you a bad name. Let me see why. Why are you doing? Why? Why are you? Why are you doing all this? I mean, let me see why. Mm, 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 mm. Well, we saying your money is broke. I mean, you ain't selling nothing. You selling? No, you ain't. You ain't doing that because you still, you still getting hit. Well, I don't know. Maybe you need all the money that you out, girl. Y'all, y'all, from what you, from what you, yeah, I, I can see it. You tricking, baby. Let me tell you. 
Okay, because healing is important. Because you hurt. Maybe y'all y'all been together a long time. So maybe y'all been through a lot of shit and you just to the point where you just like, okay, fuck it, I'm gonna do me. Maybe he done done him before. I ain't gonna go back down that route. We'll find out. It'll pop up if it needs to come up. If that's important. If you already forgave his ass for doing him and you still with him, I don't know how that even is anything that needs to come up right now. Okay. So let's see what you got to say about yourself. Okay, I said what I said. And fuck how they feel. Woo. 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 Mm. Girl. Girl. Look. Look, lady. Look, lady. We not finna put up with that shit, okay? You better get your shit together. Your ass gonna be sitting over here with me. Uh, drinking fucking water bottles and shit. <sighs> Because I don't drink, I don't smoke. I live a pretty boring-ass life. I mean, you know, considering the fact. All right? But we ain't talking about me. We talking about your ass. Okay? So, let's see. How you feeling about this? I mean, do you feel any kind of way? I don't think you feel no kind of way. You planning on leaving home. You bitch. You is finna do it up. All I can say is do what makes you happy. That's what I tell everybody. Do what makes you happy. Anyway, who, um... We seen what was in your phone. Did you go through your husband's phone? Yes or no? Uh, yeah, you went through his phone. What you see when you went through his phone? Let's find this shit out right here. Did you go through your husband's phone? No, you did not go through your husband's phone. You went through side nigga phone, side dude phone. Okay, ha! You on that other shit. All right, mama. Let's get in. You say 2021 is for you. Oh, now you thought this shit last year. What? Girl, okay, what you get from your sad nigga phone? Okay, here we go. Tringa linga ling. This is what his inbox said. Am I still saved as Pizza Hut in your phone? Oh shit. Girl, who the fuck sent him that? Okay. You know what? Let me let me let me let me see what his reply was. The sad dude. This is sad dude. Okay, so really. You ain't got no business in his phone, but I guess you need to know your place so you gonna learn your role. I guess. I ain't finna to find out, though. I'm finna to find out for you, baby, because I don't know about you. You moving funny. You moving funny as hell. Okay. Want some? Mm. Let's see what his reply box, what did he reply back to Pizza Hut? What did Sad do reply back to Pizza Hut? He said, he said, Okay, that's the last straw. Log out of my Netflix, and I'm serious this time, Chad. Is he? Okay. Sad dude. How much do we know about sad dude? It's not, it hasn't been that long. Who is Chad, and why is Chad in his Netflix? I'm reading only for grown people here. I only pick up on people's children, but I do not like to read for them. So I'm not, re- I ain't reading for no child. I ain't even finna go there with the bullshit. I ain't reading for no child. Chad is the, uh, uh, what they call it? The boyfriend or the ex-boyfriend or the ex, even if it wasn't the ex-boyfriend. Sometimes they get it on like this. They just do these things that they like to do with Chad. Okay? They don't have no title. Okay, mama? So, wife, wifey, you know we in 2021. So, you got to keep your eyeballs open. Okay? So, Chad needs to log out the Netflix. Okay? And Chad was already stored in his phone as fucking Pizza Hut. Girl, I hope you ain't throwing your um, marriage down the drain for Pizza Hut, Chad. I don't know. I ain't, I ain't hating on Chad. I feel bad for Chad. I want to pick up on Chad, but I ain't finna do all that right. Should I pick up on Chad? All right, let me let me get a couple of little. Let, first of all, let me figure out what uh wifey friend said when she came clean with all of this shit. Let's see, what did she tell them? She told them that um, mm-hmm, yeah, she told them what she tell them. Mm, 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 mm. She told them. She ain't told them shit. Cause she got hush up, silence, disre- discreet. Uh, well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Discretion, contemplation, 
uh, consideration and privacy. She ain't told her friend shit. That's why I couldn't even get it out because she don't even know what to say after she read this text messages. Mm. So, okay, let me see if I can get a little something, something on Chad. Because Chad up in this bitch, and that's for sure. So, Chad, who... Alrighty, Chad. You know what? I'm going to leave Chad ass alone. Because this ain't Chad Reed. Okay? So, whew, honey, let me tell you this like this. Husband, you and wifey, y'all need to have a serious talk. You need whatever you know or whatever you are feeling towards um her. Whatever you know about what she has done or what she is doing. You need to come to her and you really need to, to tell her to put her cards on the table. Y'all really need to talk about this. You honestly, you either need some counseling or you need to come to an agreement. Um, You know, like they say, uh, fair trade ain't a robbery. So you agree, you do you and she do. Are you doing you? Let me see. You doing you, husband? Husband, you doing you? Oh, yeah, husband, you doing you. You just a little bit more lightweight about it. Okay, well, then y'all need to, um, the the, the, the child is affected. The, the, the teenager is affected here. So, what we want to do is we want to consider him and we want to talk, mom and dad, we want to talk first. We want to uh, come to some type of understanding. Either we're going to stay together till the boy get older or either we're going to go our separate ways, right? And so... With that being said, you need to talk about that. Y'all need to handle that because the, little, the the child is hurting. Okay, he knows what's going on. He he could feel the 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 inequality, the imbalance between you you two. Okay. Also, too, let me tell you something, Dad. If you've been a fucking asshole prior to this. Then what goes around comes around. It's fucked up, but that's the way that it go. Well, Mom, you really need to cut it the fuck out. Okay. All right. So, uh, is there anything else? Let me see. What's what? Do I want? Do we know the outcome? Let me see. Let's see. A little outcome. Hmm. The message of concern. I'm not even finna go down that route. That that feel like a rabbit hole right there. The message of concern. Mom, you've been sleeping with um sad dude that uh I feel like has been sleeping with piece of her chat and um you might need to uh let me see what 14 let me see about 14 did you ask for protection bitch you need to go to the doctor okay I don't, that's all I'm got that's all I got to say anyway this is um True Friend TV, and this was you two motherfuckers, inspired by real life dilemmas. And um, if you like it, thumbs up. If you did not like it, thumbs down. If it resonated with you, leave a comment. If it did not, do not leave one, or leave one and just tell me I did a good job. But I will be doing it again on Saturday night. Okay. Alrighty. Much love. Take care. Okay, I almost forgot the zodiac sign of mom. Uh, it's Virgo. Dad is a Pisces. Uh, sad dude is Aquarius. So we have Virgo, Pisces, and Aquarius somewhere in the mix. Okay? Alrighty.